Hello everybody and welcome back to the episode of the new safe hour, jumping in again. In the previous episode, I ended up skipping Lazarus because I uh, don't trust my abilities, but I'm going to do it this time. I don't care. I'm just going to do Lazarus. Why not? I think I should just take the gamble and see what happens. Getting a luck upgrade off the bat puts on uh, zero luck, which is rather nice. It's obviously not as good as positive luck, but there you go. Anyways, get item room straight away. Pretty lovely. And we get ourselves Leo. Leo's fine. I'm not honestly my the thing I like about Leo least is just that it makes your character like model huge. I know it doesn't increase your hitbox at all, but it is a little distracting. Uh, but I will say, being able to um, stomp on tinted rocks and stuff for free, especially on the first floor, pretty useful. Being able to sort of try and find crawl space a little easier. Good stuff. Either way. How is everybody doing on this fine, fine day? What is going on? What is going on indeed? Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be killing myself much as Lazarus here. Obviously, as Lazarus, you can um, kill yourself to revive with better stats uh, that carry over, or some of them at least carry over, to the next floor. Don't know if I'm going to be doing that much, just because I think our HP might be more valuable as this character in this situation uh, when I'm doing Mother. But we'll see. We'll see. It's not set in stone right now. It's not set in stone. Extra few pennies there. Unfortunately, we're not on a floor that has a hell of a lot of pots. Um, cellar versus basement, burning basement. There's some extra HP back there. I'm going to go through here, see what's going on in here. Uh, wow. A whole lot of nothing. Probably should have left that heart until I exited that room now. That I think about it, but what's done is done. Uh, so here we get a strength card. Obviously, really not great. Strength card is... Pretty much, it's, it's not bad, it's just meh. But anyways, it's nice to be back on some Isaac. Uh, the question of the day today, hmm. The question of the day today. What is something that gives you strength? There you go, I'm holding a strength card. What's your thing that you, that you use to help find strength in difficult times, or even physically? <laughs> anyways, a nice bomb there, it's lovely. Uh, secret room is likely to be, uh, I don't know actually. I thought it was to the right, but it co of course can't be to the right. It could be to the left of here, but there's been a lot of explosions there, so maybe not. Get out of here, you. Right. It's nice to be able to get these rocks out of the way to kill this guy a lot easier, I will say that. Uh, I'm going to quickly check in my shop, even though I don't have the money to buy a full item. Uh, ooh, I almost do, actually. I almost do. Only one penny off. I don't know what that would be, but it'd definitely be an active item, right? There you go. Let's buy whatever it is. And I know that normally the 10 cent ones aren't very good. We got gamma gloves. I don't know what gamma gloves do. On use creates a small shockwave around the player pushing away nearby enemies. Okay. Technically, I could just, like, keep spamming it. I really don't like the fact that we got this boss, by the way. If you can't tell already. Do you know what? Strength card's going to make sure we don't die, but also make fighting this guy easier. Not a fan of fighting this guy ever. Oh, dude, he's just summoning so much shit. Calm yourself. <laughs> yeah, the Gamma Gloves, pretty terrible, to be honest. I suppose it is kind of like having the uh, the bean that's more reusable, but doesn't poison, so in that aspect it's kind of nice. But overall, I'd, I'd say it's not not particularly a winner. Anyways, there's him dead. Do I want to kill myself, is the question. I, I, I think I put out all the fire, so I don't even know if I can. Does this do full heart damage? Let's find out. Well, I completely missed hurting myself with it. They do, yeah. I'm going to kill myself with these. There you go. And, of course, we get the corn kernel. Ugh. Okay, we're going to try and do Mother here. I'm not particularly enthused by our current setup of items, uh, to be honest. I think we're on two full red hearts right now. Uh, so we do have to be a little careful here. Oh, God. I say that and immediately get some enemies that I'm really not a fan of. I can't even remember what this guy does. Oh, dude. Dude. You telefrag me and lose my devil deal chance? That's... Really makes me very confident about how things are going. I... Does this little dude die when everything else dies? I really hope he does. Yes, he does. Good. Otherwise, that was going to be mighty annoying. This dude. 
Now this dude's a pain in the ass. Yeah, good, good. Bugger off. Oh my god. <sighs> I'm already, like, honestly, this streak stresses me out so goddamn much. I, I'm, like, at the point now where it's like, if I lose it, I'm going to be okay. Because the, the stress of having this streak is, is genuinely a lot. Like, all of these runs are made so much more, like, spicy by this. Also, right now, I'm playing pretty bad. Luckily, I have another revive this floor, of course. But in general, not playing too hot. Ooh, that's nice. I'll take that. I'm really hoping this item room comes comes in clutch and gives us something good. Oopsie. Walked right into a explosive rock there. Just realized I don't even have a key to get into the item room yet. And I did get one from that room, but... Sadly, in a way that means that I can't actually pick it up. Oh, there's a leech there. Did not see that. I could probably, I'll probably get to die on this floor, like just via taking too much damage and do a, a natural revive. Anyways, there's a key at least. Please, please, please. I should be using my gamma gloves a little more often. I think. Um, broken cases, uh, broken shell. Sorry, is pretty decent. Is this little bomb buddy? Not too bad at all. It's just hard to keep enemies away and shoot things with the visual effect it puts on us. Not ideal. Grab that real quick. I realise these can shoot out leeches and stuff, but still. Golden Horseshoe's really not that good, but it's something. Oh, there's a half uh, soul heart in that room back there. I should go and check that out. I don't know where that came from. Was that a room reward, or is that from one of these poops? I'm not entirely sure, but I've got it now. It's helpful, at least. And I've got a Gigabomb for the boss as well here. Um, oopsie. That's not what I meant to do. Boom, bow. Nice, easy kill on him. I primed a little bomb there. Placenta. It's decent. Um... There's a half soul heart there. Do I kill myself again? There's also apparently an empty heart in this room as well, which I don't currently see. Um, I guess I'll kill myself again. Why not? Because placenta is giving us more HP back. I know I just took this half soul heart, so it's a little less meaningful now. Um, I just got to find a good place to do it. Right. Can't see where any of these are, so let's just take a random one. Wheel of Fortune, not really what I was hoping for. I think I lost a burn heart there. I had a lot more health than I thought I had there. Still, yeah, I, I, I just... Because we're not getting any stat upgrades right now, I need to make sure I'm gaining a reasonable, ma a reasonable amount of stats in general. So doing this to gain the stats is, is a good idea, even if it is a little bit risky. Oh, there's the empty heart thing. Yeah, cool. Okay, cool. I think we're good to go now. Oh, also, Placenta has a, a charge bar now, which is kind of nice. Right. Down we go. Yeah, Placenta having a charge bar is kind of interesting. You can kind of plan out when you're going to regen. And my HP is still looking good. My damage is looking a bit better now. We'll use the Gamma Gloves to keep those enemies away from me. I think I only really need to use Gamma Gloves if, if an enemy is getting a bit too close sort of thing. Oh, lovely. Lost that soul heart literally instantly. Please give us a key. Not like that, you fool. God damn it, game. God damn it, game. Hey, there you go. I'm hoping I can keep this angel deal chance alive. Or devil deal chance, should I say, at this point. But I don't know. Um, okay, we got some good stuff here. Reflux is interesting, but can be kind of bad. Basically, it means all our tears can explode. But I think I'm going to go for this instead, because it can just turn it into poop, and I think that's slightly more valuable. We've already got some explosive stuff going on. Little bit tricky in the situation I'm sat in here, but I managed to not get hit there, which is surprising actually. 
We've also got plus one luck as well right now, which means that our uh, poop tea is going to be a little bit better. I know this is going to explode. Dude. Okay. I knew that was going to explode into tears, but I didn't think it was going to work that way. I thought it was going to explode into like an eruption that I could avoid, not just hit me as soon as I touched it, which in retrospect is kind of obvious, but... Ugh. Oh, well. This is one of those runs where you just don't get devil deals, I guess. They, they happen quite a lot to me, to be honest. Should not have taken that risk. I'm not going to take that half for now. Go in here. Nice and easy on that. We get that. That's not what I wanted to do, obviously. I wanted to let it kill me. I keep forgetting I have Stompy. Also, Placenta. No. Bad timing, Placenta. Boom, there you go. Oh, what? It wasted my fucking empty heart life. That's not how that's supposed to work. Boo you, game. Boo you. Okay, good. Okay, health is looking better now. A burn heart to protect our devil deal that we'll eventually get at some point is nice. Right. Let's quickly grab this. Mirror room. I think I'm going to do my boss again in the mirror room. I know it's risky, but I have a Giga Bomb, so it's not as risky. I think, at least. I feel. Butt Penny there. It's going to take Butt Penny because it's higher chance to get stuff from there. Uh, Destroying poops, of which we're going to be spawning a lot of. Oh, we got a crawl space there as well. I don't think there'll be anything in it here, though. The only problem. There's a rainbow poop here. I wonder if that'll still be there. Um, if I go to the other side and pull us a bomb in the same spot. I don't know. Anyways, let's do this. That was bad. Actually, do you know what? It's made things easier because now he can't get across. And we do get some HP as well there. That's nice. Okay. Right, go to our item room, which is unfortunately quite far away. I don't know how risky these rooms are, though. I don't remember. Not very, by the looks of things. Not very. Should be absolutely fine here. The mini Isaacs, thank you. Good, good. Okay. And we get this key as well. Should have gone to get the other key as well, actually. Oh, well. Right. Through the mirror room we go. And what did we want to do again? We wanted to check that spot. But if it had a crawl space. Um, it was here, wasn't it? Okay, no. It just doesn't exist in this, this half of the floor. Which is slightly annoying, but eh, it is what it is. Right. Um, we are gonna go to the next floor. Got our knife piece. Still not particularly enthused on the quality of this run for killing mother. Um, I have to say. But, I guess we just keep it going and hope for the best at this point, really, don't we? And what else can we do? Hmm. Okay, that, that helped a lot, because I didn't know, I didn't really know what I wanted to do with this room. That made me feel way safer about how this was going. Extra bomb. I mean, of course, I could have just destroyed the rocks as shown there. Dude, my mini dude is so good right now. I'm loving him. Turn you into poop. Crack that open real quick. Ooh. Enough for a shoppy shoppy. I like that. I like enough to go to the shop. And yeah, our damage now is like pretty decent. I would like a fire rate increase from my boss at some point here though. That would make me feel a lot better. Good. Ah, oh, we only we only just have one key, so can't do that yet. I'll, I'll I'll do this just in case we had a key here. Mini Isaacs is better than um thingy. 
Anything else? Although, like I said, you do get extra stuff from the poops from this. So maybe I should keep this. For the extra poop stuff. Oh god, I do not like the situation I found myself in here. Okay, there you go. That sort of ironed itself out. Ooh. Don't remember what these guys do exactly. Hoping I'll just turn them into a poop eventually. There you go. And then same with these guys. They move really weirdly, don't they? Oh god. Okay. These enemies are not what I thought they were. I do not like the way that they move either. These, this is hella sporadic movement. Really, really, yeah, really, really hard to avoid. I'm going to lose my burn heart in here, aren't I? Okay, not quite. I did not like that at all. Quickly go back and fill up my burn heart again. I might even go to the devil deal now that we're, like, so late on the uh, angel deal. Like, at this point, it might just make more sense to go devil deal. Oh, dude. The shots are so nice. Imagine getting this with Jacob's Ladder. Now, that would be awesome. Because then it would, like, travel through all the enemies and turn them all into poops at once. See if that happens. See if we get lucky enough. Wow, a little portal. The mulligan? Not bad at all. Not bad at all. I like the mulligan. And we did indeed get another uh, key here, so we can go to our shop now. Secret room maybe here. There you go. Ooh, soul house. That's nice. Do I want to kill myself this floor? Probably not, actually. I think I'm... I think I've done enough killing of myself for now. Didn't mean to do that, but oh well. Okay. Right. Back to the shop. See what's what. Yeah, probably want to trade out gamma gloves when possible as well, because that hasn't really done much for us recently. Um, the sweet is the sweet better. On use, hold up a throwable projectile. Um, press to fire fire to throw in a direction. If it hits a monster, it becomes permanently charmed and persistent. It also attempts to Icarus style upgrade. Yeah, I guess that's better than gamma gloves. Decent. Okay. This could th this sweet thing could be good. Permanently charmed familiars. Seems potentially useful. Definitely better than gamma gloves, I'd say. Okay. Um, I think we just go straight for the boss here. It's Singe. Singe isn't too bad. Fight that bomb away from me, though. He unfortunately killed my friend, but I kind of expected that. I just need little blocks to stop me hitting him. Where's he landing? There you go. He farted that bomb into himself. Lovely. All good. We get black heart and damage. Yeah, I'm definitely going to go devil deal here. We have enough HP to make it work. Unfortunately, however, we did get kind of shafted. But, but, I tell you what though. I am going to take it. Quarter I'm not too interested in. But the extra life, it's an extra life. I mean... In any case, although I do think there's a bug with this extra life where it'll revive you as this one before it'll revive you as, um... So, it will take precedent, essentially. Our Lazarus revive will come after the Fiend revive. Which is a little annoying. At least last time I used it, that was the case. Uh, it might not be the case still. We do have a Steven floor here. Steven? Steven floor I could definitely go for, I think. Although, would Steven floor work here? I don't think I'd be able to carry on the mother path I did Steven floor, would I? There you go. Charm that bad boy. I wonder if he'll stay a champion between rooms. Or if it'll change when he goes into the next room here. Oh no, he's still a champion. Nice. Got an empty heart here as well. Yeah, I don't think I'll be able to go mother if I do this. But yeah, I have more health and deal more damage as a champion, so that's good. Got a good, very nice. Copper bombs to all bombs. It's kind of whatever. Right. Oh, he fucking died to a fire, didn't he? Oh, I accidentally hit that ghost there. That's not who I meant to hit at all. We got a luck upgrade here. And... T 
Tears down? Okay, that's real bad. That's why I don't take pills, people. Rubik's Cube. It's so potentially useful, but it could just not change for ages, so I'm not going to take it. And I get Mr. Boom. Okay, just another active value. I'm getting a bit annoyed now. This run's kind of, kind of poopy stinky. The butt penny thing is getting a little tedious now. Literally just taking this so I can buy it for the stat, buy stuff for stats. Yeah, honestly, I'm gonna get rid of butt bomb. It's really annoying me. Uh, but but Penny, sorry. Lego stud. Lego stud. Buy that. Buy that. Right, just buy everything for stats. I didn't get any fire rate increase there, which is annoying. Should have taken the quarter as well now, knowing this. Good. <sighs> go buy something else from the shop. I, sh I should save my money, actually, just in case. I'm definitely going to go to the um, thingy floor, though, but I... I need more money if I'm going to do that, that, though, really, don't I? I should have saved my money. Secret room, lovely. Dude, you can't be serious. Um, How do I do this? Is there a way I can do this to, to patch, patch across? I feel like there is, and I'm not quite sure how. First of all, just, just plant this here. Hmm. What was the other card in the shop? Was it by any chance the Hanged Man? Although I get a doubt that it is, but I need to check. We got Wheel of Fortune, Magus. Wheel of Fortune, I guess... Pop. Oh, that's a bomb. I don't know how I managed to do that. Um, guess bomb this. Hmm. I'm going to be really annoyed if I can't get Glitch Crown this floor, because that's... That could solve a lot of problems for us. <laughs> A lot of problems. Um, so I'm going to try my best to get it, but I have a feeling the game is going to not give me any opportunity to grab it, is it? I, I don't think there's any way I can like get over it without flight either. That's the problem. That's nice. That's good. We'll take that. I'm just trying to think if there's any way I can do it. I think it's just going to be a card or something else that gives me flight for a room. Which aren't um, super common. Maybe the room name had a hint in it. I didn't see. Right. Quickly do the boss. Hemolacria shot there. Mulligan's producing some flies for us here and there. Just careful of the Hemolacrias. They're a little bit spicy. Not too hard to avoid. Still, definitely spicy. Oh god, almost stepped in the red creep there as well. Yeah, I can't even do the Stephen floor as well, which is annoying. So we get that. Please give us flight here. Ugh. This isn't great. I, I do have to take that, though, because it's good. That, that would be nice, but I can't afford it, really. Mausoleum. 
the second secret room here. That it is. Do I want to try and play... Okay, so I'm going to blow up these three. I've got two of them. Nose Goblin definitely taking that. We'll try and play this for a card that gives us flight. Wasn't expected, but there you go. Decent trinket there, but we've got a better one right now. Soul Heart's nice. Another trinket. Really holding out for this card here. It's all my money, but... Dude, didn't give me any cards. Yeah, bomb these two then. Got a lot of soul hearts though. Got a lot of soul hearts. It was rather nice. My tears are so low right now. Ah, dude, glitch crown. You bastard. Um. Basically, if I th if I hit manage to throw a bomb into the middle, it'll it'll pit over the gaps, using those spiked rocks. It'll I'll, I'll take damage going across, but I'll at least be able to get it. But I don't have any way to throw a bomb over there. Hmm. Thing is, basically now, is do I actually stick to the path of going mother? Because it's not looking good. It's not looking good at all. Very annoyed to not be able to get Glitch Crown here at all in any way, shape, or form. It's truly, truly depressing. Hmm. Trying to sort of work it out. Let me go and get another charge for Mr. Boom, because I think I need the slightly bigger radius. And I think... I think I've got a plan, but I don't know if it's going to work. I, I don't think it's going to work, to be fair, but I've got to try. Basically, what my thinking is, is if I, pla if I destroy the red poops and then plant the bomb... Well, no, so I've got, basically I've got to have the poops gone when the bomb explodes. Yeah. So I need to go bomb here and then do that. Nah, I've just ruined it. Nothing I can do, that is very depressing. Um, I guess I'll keep on the mother path here, but I'm not particularly enthused. Not particularly enthused. We'll see how it goes, though, I guess. I'm, I mean, my main problem right now is my fire rate is, is so unbelievably low. And I lost all of my money um, when I could have used it for other things. My health actually isn't too bad right now. Apart from when I get hit twice in a row. Nice. That's very good. We'll take that. Oh, that hurt me. Okay, we've got the Yara effect going. Not particularly happy with my HP right now. Taking a lot of very, very dumb damage. Good. Got some money back. I'm hoping we can get a lot of money and buy some stuff from the shop. Because I'm really hoping Keeper's Sack can give me some, um, some stats. Ah! So some, some stats to uh, my fire rate. Good thing is about this uh, setup, we are doing a good bit of damage with these fires and stuff, which is nice. Secret room. There's that money I was looking for. Lovely. Okay, let's go to our shop real quick. Buy an item. I, I don't even care if I don't want it. Just buy it for the stats. Keep a sack is really strong. Cool, cool. You bastard. Why did I not expect this? I mean, I've got more money for the next floor now, but why did I not expect this was going to happen? This should have been obvious. 
that should have been apparent <laughs> that was going to happen. I mean, we'll get we'll get ultra greed on the next floor as well, even though we desperately need to buy as much as we possibly can. Studs everywhere. They don't really make much of a difference to us. Ooh, we do have a tainted treasure room here, although I'm not entirely sure what it is. Get hit by a champion as well. That's good. Right. You want to take away Leo. You can smash through walls and loop to the other side of the room. I just... It's intriguing, but I just don't see how useful that is. I guess I'll take it. I just... Yeah. Doesn't seem all that good to me. I'll be honest. Probably rather have the ability to smash rocks, to be honest. I can't even go straight into a secret room, either. This is BS. Dude, the amount of money we have right now and no ability to spend... Like, or buy stuff, should I say? Oh yeah, that's horrible. I accidentally just grazed against the wall and completely... Uh, this, 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 this thing might fuck me over, actually. This thing might be horrible. I took it because it was novel. I don't like it. Fifty percent chance to, co to cost coins instead. I mean, that technically could be quite good for us. I'll take that. Because we've got so much money right now. Oh, dude. I hate this item. Why did I take this? Why did I think this would be a good idea? Oh, fuck at that. Dude, get to a position where I can hit you, you fool. Right. Cat food. It's just not very good. Wow, that's helped. Oh my god, this is tragic. Okay, I officially, th this might be the worst item in the game. Oh, and I just hurt myself with the fire from this item, because I forgot it does that. Okay, this this might be a loss to our streak, actually. This this could be. I've, I've, I've very much squandered things this floor. Oh, good, the saw blade. That's nice. Dude, I hate, I hate this. This is awful. I do not want to swap sides of the room. It's so confusing. Okay, those saw blades. Why don't they disappear at the end of combat? Come on now. This is awful. This is the worst. This item is just tragically trash. Oh, dude. Why would I ever want to do that? That's awful. I've got to cut, like... Just avoid walls like the plague. That is genuinely disgusting how bad that is. That's, that's so gross. Oh my god, this is this is not going well. Not going well at all. Right. Oh, we have the Yero effect permanently now as well. I forgot that was a thing. Yeah, can't destroy rocks now, but can fuck myself over massively by accidentally walking into a wall. Which is something that you do constantly in this game. Do it like that, then. I'll stop reviving them, you gim. Oh my god, it's so annoying. I didn't want to do that at all. Like, if you can remember about it, it's kind of useful, but I'm never going to remember about it. I'm always going to do it by accident. It's never going to be something I do on purpose. Yeah, not being able to destroy walls is a bit of a bummer now as well. Uh, not, not walls, you know what I meant. Wow, our item selections have been real good recently. 
Contagion's not awful, but it's it's really not going to be what we need to save this run. Oh, that saved me there, that time. Just about. Right. Shop, please be good. Be good to me, shop. Key beggar, I don't, I don't know what to think of you. At least we're doing good damage with the fires and stuff. Like I said, I still need more fire rate to make it more viable. Right now, it's a little bit iffy. Get out of here, you crow bastards. Like, we're like one-shotting most enemies right now with the uh, burning effects included. Oh, God. Should have just done that in the first place. What's going on here? How did I take damage there? I'm, 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 I'm confused by that. Oh god, what is this room? This room's horrible. Thank god I had that little dude to help me out there. That was just no. We're going to lose our devil deal again here, and I really need it, because I need good items, and I need to be able to buy stuff with my trinket. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. Why is the... Yeah, what's going on with this? So, what the fuck's this enemy about? Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. I hate this! Fucking stop! We're the fiend now. Item, literally the most trash I've ever seen in my entire life. This item will go down history as the worst item to ever exist. Why on earth did I pick this bullshit up? I, yeah, I don't understand what was happening in those rooms. The room got slowly darker and then I just took damage? Like, what the fuck's that about? Like, I, I couldn't avoid anything there. Right, this shop better not have fucking greed in it. Okay, it didn't, but it's not got a lot to purchase either, so... That's all the spiders. <sighs> God damn. Um, I guess I'm just doing the boss here. Why well, I didn't bash through the wall at all there, no. Oh god. Right, we we'll definitely will not be doing mother here. There's no way. <laughs> There's no way. We're gonna do dark path. Fuck off down this way. I'm still not enthused at all this run's gonna go well though. I'm gonna end up walking through a wall and killing myself. I can just see it now. Like that. Oh my god, it's so frustrating. No one ever wants to do that. Ever. No one in the history of ever will ever want to do that. Oh my god. And we're playing as a character now that is pretty difficult. Okay. Die via fire, please. Oh, the heads are still alive. I didn't see that. At least I can gain health with this guy, but it doesn't help me when I get hit multiple times in a room, though, does it? Keys. Don't know what I'll use them for, but there you go. 
Did we get... Have we got even less fire rates since last time? I thought we had 1.9 something at some point. 1.5 something. Oh god, this is Mother's Heart already. Oh god, as well. Dude, no. No. You cannot be travelling through the wall on this fight. We're dead. This is, the streak is over, people. The streak is over. This is... This item literally killed me. Like, the room wasn't great anyways. But this item has killed me. I don't even know what to say. Like... I don't even know what to say. I go stud. Why isn't it even me firing? Dude, fuck off doing that. No one cares. Fuck's sake. And I went the wrong fucking way. God damn it. Ah. <sighs> Why? I just, I can't fathom. I genuinely, I just can't understand why anyone would ever want this. I need a black heart so I can like space out my health a little bit. Uh, I got hit. I'm dead. That's the streak over, people. That is the streak over. Unfortunate. So, when I was saying about being pussy and not wanting to play Lazarus, I was fairly right. But that... That item, the Leo whatever bullshit... There's a lot of things that went wrong there, but that item... Killed us. 100%. That is the worst item in the entirety of Modded Binding of Isaac. I will never, as long as I live, ever touch that thing ever again. That is a devastating loss to the streak. And it's just... Yeah, that item's just horrible. Why Why would anyone ever want that to work that way? Ever. I just... I cannot fathom it. It's a ridiculous idea for an item. It's just not useful at all. It just isn't. You, you're like... Holding yourself up against a wall to avoid enemies is like a staple of the Binding of Isaac. I don't know why I didn't think about this before I took it. Uh, anyways, either way, I hope you guys enjoyed. There goes the streak, and I will see you guys in the next one.